team in Portland that you absolutely can take advantage of them and get some easy buckets. And here is Chris Murray guarded by his twin. They're missing a lot of take firepower a today, right? Yes, so he is. Is. <laughs> Domas on the down low. Counted in one for Harrison Barnes. An action. Keon Ellis with the fat. Kings in transition here. Ellis, his first pull. So that th they don't have any hope in yeah, this game. Yeah, yeah. Kind of what I was saying earlier. Yeah. You don't want to give them confidence. Right. And the way you do it is the hustle plays. They got a couple offensive boards already in this one. Uh, made way more opportunities than the Kings have. Here comes De'Aaron Fox. Nice little drive and kick. Great ball movement. Money by Keegan. Continuing HB plan is 222nd straight game as the Kings turn it over. Their first bat getting downhill. Fox getting to his spot. High Arthur here. Fox with his first spot. Is making the Kings have to play a lot of defense early on. Oh, swiper. Took his lunch money and the lefty lamp is good. Back-to-back -back buckets from D. Fox. Oh, look at the activity. Fox one more time with the hammer. Midway through the first quarter, game 82 of the season, and that guy right there, the Energizer Bunny, not slowing down. 12 of their shots have been behind the arc. Oh, oh Trey Lyles. Yeah. Good look for Davion. Bang, bang, bang. Strong low post. Hey. They're getting up some yeah, they're getting up. They're, got, they're one of 14 from deep right now. Oh, Keegan took a bump. Still cashed in. Murray. 15 of their first 22 shots have been from behind the arc. Deep position by Tomas. Nice find. Counted. HP. We've seen the head-to-head. -head. Yes, we've, we've seen the head-to-head. -head. Thank you. You you were, you were found a much better way to say it. I was looking for a diplomatic way, and it just wasn't coming to me. Oh, a nice little move there. But he is, you cannot say that he is not included in that. Oh, God, oh man. Yeah, you. Turned on the Jets, huh? To game 82, you're so ready for right. it to be over, because it has been mentally and emotionally taxing. Yeah. His second threes. Well, and he's also he's he's playing it against top tier defender. Yes. You know, you talk about yeah. the minutes he's getting in the kind of the close of this season in a in a major major way. And listen, I don't know what's going to happen after this game. Yeah. You know, we're not going to be broadcasting the play in from for his work in the community as well. And you know, he's a fan favorite here, and we hope he uh, comes back. Monty McNair and the King bring this guy back because he he's a it's tough to be a part of them. Right, right. As a, as a player, yeah. it's tough to be a part of because it is really just an odd mm -hmm. feeling in there. So, you know, he put in a lot of time in the offseason, and then he had a rough go of it. A lot of right. DNPs early in the season just trying to figure out his spot and, and his minutes. But, man, his opponent. Deion signed a three-year, $5 million deal. Was a two-way player. He fought maybe in his back right now. You know, being very deliberate about their actions, about their mentality in the game. And I'm telling you, it is so challenging when you're playing a team in the situation that Portland is. And with all the different guys, I mean, Blazers get to double digit scoring in this second quarter, had 18 in the first quarter. And up to that point, still in single digits. So the team is just continuing to run their stuff. Though. That's a turnover, so. And if you're the king, yeah. I mean, unlike most games that you're going to be playing in, it's worth your while now with this big lead to kind of from three pointers. And man, I mean, that says a lot when you got someone like Peja Stojakovic yeah, sitting, sitting courtside, courtside yeah. right now. Ben to the basket. You know, it's interesting. You know, Chris Weber's in the building as well. And Fox finds Domas on the inside. I, I was watching Chris and I texted with Mike Bibby. Mike Bibby not in town. But I know he's uh, watching De'Aaron Fox put in work tonight. Fox, a little start and go. Keon Scoop counted. Ellis in double figures with 11. Two guys on this roster that have been available for every single game this season. You look back a year ago, 
you know, this is something we've, we've come to expect from Harrison Barnes. DeMontis Sabonis played 79 games a year ago. So reliable and dependable. Here comes De'Aaron Fox, already with 19, looking for more. He's got a 21 piece. By the way, your dominant hand is your left, but we're going to turn you into a right-handed right, right. shooter, and you're going to come in and you're going to break records, and right. you're going to, you know. Yes. Oh. Looks to be in some pain. Air. Just the third triple. And Mike Brown is going to keep you updated on that score. Right now, it's Kings up by 29. Bob Reed. Man, he's got two. To this degree yeah. for quite some time. Wap Reed running one hander. No. Man, how's they more? He's been. Yeah, he's playing hard. He's rebounding the ball. That was something. You know, you look back to, to Keegan in his first year yeah. as Harrison Barnes is able to get one to fall at the cup. You know, Keegan, uh, yeah, they're, the they're, they're different. Yeah. They're, they're, they're identical, but they're identically different. Right? Strong on the step back, but off night tracks it down. Barnes, three ball, bang, got it. HB with a in that program for them, and I have really liked his game a lot over the years. But he didn't get a lot of playing time. Right, right. There in Toronto, so I'm happy to see him in a situation. He can finish eighth, ninth, or tenth. If they win, they have an opportunity at eight or nine. Not like well when it comes, yep. comes down to it. It's, uh, he's the first Kings to, to, he's got over 1,500 points. He's got over 1,100 rebounds, over 660 assists. You know, you get numb to it. You get yeah. numb to just exactly how special the season he is having is. You know, some people will say, well, he's a center. What do you expect? Mm. No, nah, but largest lead of the game. Turnover. Edwards, nice find to Davion for the layoff. Good job by Kessler Edwards defensively. Here, Caitlin Clark the other day talking about just growing up in Iowa and who she idolized. I did not. Yeah, I did not. I did see her on SNL, though. Yeah, she was funny on <laughs> SNL. You know, he just tries to, to fit in, you know, where he can. And I love that he's been able to, you know, kind of open the door for other people and not from picking up their 46th win of the season. They now will turn their attention to the play-in tournament, which begins Tuesday as JaVale McGee. Here's more. Oh, jab step. Oh, oh. Okay, time for more. Chris Murray, 38 minutes, 17 rebounds. I mean, he truly has not come off the floor. Here he is in transition. An easy one. Look at all the talent in street clothes for Portland as Moore knocks down another one. 7.41 left to go in the fourth. If everything holds as is, Sweet pass Maybe. by JaVale McGee. They sort of hit their stride as of late. As they have. No, JaVale, yes. Well, her guys are playing up with the big club, yes, you know? Yes. Their season over, they played so hard for her. She did such a great job with them, and it's got to be rewarding to see them on this floor. To win, I want to give a shout out to Rodas, Mike Bird, Joshua, Justin Halls, and all the talented crew here.